more so in recent years, there is a real need for constitutional lawyers to come to the fore, as it were, um, and engage in a wider discussion that uh, involves the public and not just uh, amongst themselves within the realms of academia. Um, so I think that by characterizing uh, terrorism as a, as a constitutional problem and educating, hopefully, uh, a wider audience about these constitutional underpinnings and the effects of, uh, for example, successive British government's responses, uh, counter-terrorism policies, uh, particularly in the post-9-11 era, I think that that has uh, the potential to, to open up the debate.